Planet Zoo has been rated E10 plus by the ESRB for crude humor, mild blood, and mild violence. It is generally suitable for people aged 10 years and up. This video is sponsored in part by Violent Mind, the first volume in the Animal in Man series by Joseph Asfani. Maxon, a cunning fox, stalks the Lioran capital city of Crosswall as a shadow, a lone operative for the city guard who must never be seen or heard and never engage with the enemy. But when he's caught in an explosion that levels a city block, the fox ignores his mission and retrieves a dangerous artifact that could bring the whole planet of Herbridia to its knees. The Relay, a weapon that turns civilized animals into savage beasts. Get your copy at Amazon.com today. Hey folks, this is Jack. Welcome back to Planet Zoo. Welcome back to the Sequoia Park Zoo. Um, the zoo's doing pretty good. Uh, before we get started, let's let's do a couple of housekeeping matters. We got a visiting VIP player. Uh, okay, there's that. Um, anything on the notifications? We got offspring, offspring, new animal. Oh, the caracals are fighting. Are they still fighting? You can't even tell it's a caracal for him. Hey, oh, you know, that's not true. Well, okay, we just got some sort of thingy with the caracals, so let's look at the caracals. Okay, they are not... Temperature. Okay, it's too cold for them. So let's, uh... Let's put heater. Let's put a couple of heaters down. All right, let's have it go to, say, 60, 65 degrees. Surely they can tolerate 65 degrees. That way it's not like burning hot, but it's not, uh, not freezing either. We'll put it under the trees to disguise it. And of course, as soon as I lay the thing down, they don't need it anymore. We're going to put another one in here. There we go. Okay. Anything else? Um, okay, the new the new Eurasian lynx. Yes, uh, off camera, one of the Eurasian lynx died. So I went ahead and replaced her. Now the other Eurasian lynx... The male is elderly, so he needs to be rehomed. I'm going to go looking for a new male Eurasian lynx. And here we go. Okay. All right, what exactly is the problem? It's not letting me adopt him. Hold on a second. Okay. Alright, I can release him to the wild. I can release the newly mature... ...animal to the wild. Okay, we have a new baby llama. That's cool. But why will it not let me adopt the male... ...region legs? Refresh list. No, he's still there. 
It's not like I don't have the money for it. Oh, the listing expired. Oh, well. Then why is he still on the list? Okay, that was weird. That was truly weird. The listing for the male Eurasian lynx had expired, but he was still showing up on the list, and it wasn't telling me why I couldn't. You know what? I'm just going to get a second female. All right. Okay, so anyway, that's all the housekeeping we need to do right now, but I did want to show you guys something. This is the impending snow leopard habitat. Um, what happened was I, I, I went, you know, this is going to be a big complex build. I should probably do a little bit of it prior, you know, a little preparatory landscaping. Well, two hours later, I had all this and I suddenly went, why haven't I not been recording this? So I stopped and started recording. And But, you know, this is what you see. This is everything we've got so far on the snow leopard uh, habitat. I do have snow leopards. Ignore the thing about the tortoises and the sea mangs. That's for another uh, a zoo I'm doing off camera. Um, I do play this game and, you know, without recording everything. Amazing as it sounds. All right, let's see. Snow leopard. Right, I've got two. Okay. And it's snowing again. Yay. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, turn this over to the time lapse. And I will talk to you shortly.
I'll be honest, for as much as this is a great habitat, I mean, look at it, it's just gorgeous. Um, and it certainly fills every need that the snow leopards have. I got to admit, it's actually a dumb design. They've got like three times as much room as they need. The viewer, the, you know, the guests, they can't get a good view of these animals. And this is an animal that doesn't do well in crowds. So there's never going to be more than like one or two adults and a couple of babies in this in this thing. So... Yeah, uh, you know, for, for, for as much as it's a beautiful habitat and I wanted to do a big, luxurious habitat, it's just inefficient. Now, the one thing I did like is that I put like five or six caves in this thing, so they've got plenty of places to hide, plenty of places to sleep. They are a very shy species, and I wanted to give them lots of hiding space. I wanted to get them lock of, a lot of blockage so they're out of the view of the guests, and I think I got that done. <sighs> Overall, I'm ha you know don't get me wrong, I'm happy with it. I'm just admitting that it that, that if this was a real zoo, they never would have built this as the habitat for the snow leopard. Anyway, guys, if you liked what you just watched, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. I can always use the, the subscribers. Um, if you don't want to subscribe, that's fine. Just please hit that like button. It helps me in the algorithm. If you do subscribe, also hit the notification bell so you don't miss a single one of my videos. Leave a comment down below. I'd love hearing from you. And I will talk to you guys later. The next episode, I believe, is going to be the Clouded Leopard as we continue the cats. We've only got two more cats left to go. The Clouded Leopard and the Cougar. And the next one's going to be the Clouded Leopard. So I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye. The jungle, as old and as true as the sky The forest protected shall prosper The forest neglected shall die You have an aptitude to change attitudes Cause we have to prove it That's right it too Grab your shovel There's work to do The world's in trouble You gotta build a zoo